Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe After Effects CC 2021. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the posterized time expression so you can go from a smooth animation to more of a choppy stop motion feel. First, we're going to rotate this logo layer. I'm going to tap on R for rotation. I'm going to press the Option key and click on the stopwatch next to rotation. This will allow us to add an expression. For the expression, I'm just going to type in time, asterisk, that's shift 8, and just type in any number you want. I'm going to type in 150 for this example. And now you can see that my logo is looping in an endless rotation. If you want to speed up the animation, just type in a larger number. So if I type in 360, that means that every second it's going to rotate 360 degrees. Slow it down, just type in a lower number. to add the posterized time expression so we can give it more of a stop motion feel. You can select the layer and twirl down the properties until you see the rotation property where that expression is, or the keyboard shortcut if you tap on the letter E two times, so EE, -E, that'll bring up all expressions. Just click in the timeline. I'll tap the up arrow. I wanna type in the posterized time expression above the time expression that we already entered. So I'm going to start typing in lowercase p. So we're going to spell out posterize. You'll see it starts to populate. I'll hit enter or return. The posterized time expression will allow you to change the frame rate. So in the parentheses, we need to tell it what frame rate we want this to be. I'm going to type in something like six. If I click off there and hit the space bar now, and now we have that stop motion feel. And just play with the values until you find a speed that you like. That is how you can use the posterized time expression to give a stop motion feel to the rotation property. My name is Mike Murphy. That is your quick tip in Adobe After Effects CC 2021. Cheers.